the address is CBS Television Studios logo bloopers. Welcome home. Episode 15, PBS Stations. Before we cue the CBS Television Studios logo, we have more guests in the studio. What are your names? I'm Pinkie Pie. I'm Twilight Sparkle. I'm Rarity. I'm Rainbow Dash. I'm Applejack. I'm Fluttershy. I'm Princess Celestia. I'm Princess Luna. And I'm Princess Cadence. Thank you all for your great welcomes. So anyways, roll camera. Cue the CBS Television Studios logo. WJBH Television Studios. Boston is here to light up in the color orange on public television. Is there something wrong? You idiots. WGPH is not the affiliate of BPS we work in. In addition, this is not BPS, this is CBS. Get it right. Okay, okay, okay. Sheesh. And shush the sheesh. MPB Television Studios. Short for Mississippi Public Broadcasting. Its most notable contributions was Between the Lions, a children's educational show on PBS Kids. VPT Television Studios. Short for Vermont Public Television. The VPT name lasted from 1997 to May 2014. It was Mr. Richardson's PBS station during his residence in Montreal suburbs. WCFE Television Studios. Also known as Mountain Lake PBS. WTVS Television Studios. AKA Detroit Public Television. WTVS Detroit Public Television Channel 56. All hail the sun's horizon over the planet. IPT Television Studios. Short for Idaho Public Television. IPT produced public TV programs such as Outdoor Idaho. Now it's KSPS Television Studios, a PBS station in Spokane, Washington. Mr. Richardson's current PBS station from his residence in Calgary. WFSU Television Studios. A PBS station in Tallahassee, Florida. A service of Florida State University. If you ever lived in Tallahassee, this would be your PBS station. And if you ever lived in Panama City, WFSG would be the satellite to it. WFSG would also be the PBS station where I take vacations on the Panama City Beach. Now that's my favorite PBS station. <laughs> WIPB Television Studios, what next? <laughs> now that's my second favorite PBS station. Maybe Mr. Richardson, who's the boss, will make a top 10 PBS stations for you. He will. That would be a great idea. Now it's KPBS Television Studios, a PBS station in San Diego, California. A service of the San Diego State University. The PBS station of San Diego Comic Con International. Because the KPBS logo is multicolored, I should be called the girl with KPBS hair. San Diego is here to make a rainbow in the sky. I will quick scope an M8. What's next? WEDU Television Studios. WEDU Television Studios. The affiliate of PBS in Tampa, St. Petersburg, Sarasota, Lakeland, Florida. Clear water is here to crash the waves at the beach beneath your feet and between your toes. WKNO Television Studios. What's next? KQED Television Studios. Next thing you know, they'll have WNED Television Studios. For God's sake, Scotty and Kate, this is not WNED Television Studios. 
This is CBS Television Studios. And this is not PPS in addition, like I said before. Holy Lord. It's Queen Chrysalis. Grab hold of the nearest cross you can find. Chill out, girls. It's not you that I've come for. I've come for Microsoft Sam. You brown queen. You dare invade an episode of CBS Television Studios logo bloopers? We were having a lot of fun ourselves. In addition, casting director Donna Egbert has assigned me and the rest of the My Little Pony gang to the studio, including an evil villain like you, Queen Chrysalis. We've got a good mind to call on God to take you away. You heard her, Queen Chrysalis. There is no justification for any evil acts you do against Sam and his friends, not to mention that of Owen Nelson and his friends, even the My Little Pony gang. You stay out of my office, Sam, Sam, you infernal beast. beast. Take that. Take that. Curses. Foiled by the Almighty for the very first time in a 2021 remake of CBS Television Studios' Load of Bloopers. The next time I come back here, Microsoft Sam and his friends will be mine forever. Sore losers, Sore losers. Yes. 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 yes, yes, prophets, prophets. No. no. Thank God Queen Chrysalis has vanished. I agree with you, Princess Cadence. We are all okay now from all this horridness. <laughs> Oh no. It's Lucifer and Lucretia McEvil. Save us, Jesus. That's right, it is us. And this time, we come for Microsoft Sam's soul. Not so fast there, Lucifer and Lucretia McEvil. We take things seriously, seriously in the bounds, in the of, bounds my of my authority. authority. And you'll and feel you'll my wrath for any for evil any stuff, you, stuff do. you do. Interfere with just punishment and we will poop and pee all over Sam, Owen Nelson, their friends and the My Little Pony gang. That's disgusting. Defy, Defy my authority, authority and we and will have, have, have you. Have in addition, addition take, that. take that. Curses. Foiled by the Almighty for the very first time in a 2021 remake of CBS Television Studios logo bloopers. Goodbye forever. You've won the battle this time, Lucifer and Lucretia McEvil, but you've lost the war. Thank God Lucifer and Lucretia McEvil are gone. I agree, Florida. We're all safe now from this lucid nightmare. It seems that the people working at Sony Music Canada are in the clear. Now let's continue with a logo. Agreed, honey. <laughs> My Little Pony. That's right, we are the My Little Pony Gang. We are human in equestrian girls and ponies in friendship is magic. I have rainbow colors in my hair. The pink in my hair matches the color of Pinkie Pie's hair and skin. The My Little Pony Gang is on their feet. Uh-oh. I think we goofed. I guess we should be punished. Don't worry. When Lucifer and Lucretia McEvil let loose on me, Owen Nelson, our friends and the My Little Pony gang, even Queen Chrysalis, I regretted letting you to go. You're rehired, Scotty and Kate. Thanks. Good afternoon, everyone. This is Owen Nelson. And this is Felicity, and welcome to CBS News Los Angeles. KCBS TV Channel 2. And we have a follow up report that just took place since last time Mr. Richardson received a request on My Little Pony. Lucifer and Lucretia McEnall, along with Queen Chrysalis, have gotten their comeuppance. And Mr. Richardson need not worry about Sony Music Canada's licensing maneuvers, even those maneuvers of any other company. 21st Century Cinemation founder Trevor Hayes is right about the copyright and other licensing issues. However, Hasbro is wrong, and let's let it go at that. Keep watching this channel for future episodes of CBS Television Studios Logo Bloopers. This is CBS News Los Angeles signing off.
STC Fetish Muffin, a division of the STC Digital Enterprise Group Incorporated, encourages you to like, comment, share, and subscribe to the STC Fetish Muffin official YouTube channel for more videos.